Alright, now I'm going to be doing another movie night. Now there's the time, it's 9.48pm. It's Friday, the 17th. Alright, now I'm going to be watching Vacancy 2, the first cut. Okay, now it's 9.59. I'll pause the video now, I don't really have anything to say about it because I haven't even seen the movie. But, yeah, here, so, I'll just uh, sort of, like, read the description, but nothing about my own opinion, because I don't really have anything to say about it, but, anyways, here's the disc to it. After checking into a, a dingy uh, uh, room uh, at a remote uh, meadow view in uh, a newly engaged couple, so I'm assuming this might have different characters, anyways, uh, right, and, uh, uh, yeah, their mutual friend began to suspect they're being watched. Uh, little do they know where they're also being uh, uh, hunted and their death will be caught on camera. So, yeah, murderous uh, Mr. Smith and his grisly prequel original thriller. Yeah, so I'll give this a try. It seems kind of interesting, but anyways, I guess... That's all I have to say for it, and it is uh, 10 1 p.m. So, yeah, I'm gonna cut the video, and that's it. Bye. Okay, it's 11 39, and I just got watching. I was uh, finished uh, with the movie Vacancy 2, the first cut. Now it is Friday, 6 17. Okay. okay. I just got done watching Vacancy 2. Now, with this movie, uh, you find out it's actually a prequel because it's the first cut, and it's, uh, like, showing how it all started. Now, me personally, I think this movie was kind of unnecessary and violent at the same time. Like, this movie didn't really resolve much uh, in the end, really. I enjoyed uh, the first uh, one, uh, Vacancy. I thought that was uh, a fairly well done uh, horror thriller. And, uh, but this movie just uh, goes all the way to the beginning, pretty much showing how it starts, like, where there's this uh, person uh, raping a woman with a knife, and it's caught on video, and they sort of work together and decide to make snuff films. But that's... Uh, you know, that was kind of cool, like, uh, how it started, and uh, I will say that near the beginning I was kind of interested in how the story would be. Like, it had sort of a good idea to it, but really they didn't really do much with the story. But another part, well, there's uh, another scene uh, in the movie that I will say I actually thought was pretty good. The scene where they go into the house, uh, like, where they're trying to escape, and then... Uh, they call, try to call the police, uh, but then they shoot the two people in the house. That part I thought was pretty cool. And some of the torture scenes were good as well, but a movie as, uh, of uh, all together as in being well made, I didn't really think this movie did it for me. If you want to see something new, I would recommend you skip it, because if you've seen the first one, you've pretty much seen the second one as well. It's pretty much like the same idea and the concept, uh, and yeah, I was kind of disappointed because of that, but I'm not really sure what I'm gonna rate it. I might think a little bit more about this movie, but yeah, I guess uh, that's it for uh, now. Okay, so I hope you all enjoyed this video, and that's gonna be it, so subscribe, like, and share this video, and that's it. Bye.